here I am at the highest point of the map. I don't think I can physically get any higher than this. Right at the top of Mount Chiliad and also on top of this little satellite dish thing. I kind of want to get down off here though. Um, and that's probably going to hurt me, right? Oh, no, it's okay. Pluto gravity. We're going to slowly descend down. Right, Pluto gravity. If I go off here, will I fly? I'm not flying! Ah! No! No! <laughs> no! <laughs> no! <laughs> I wanted to fly like E.T. This isn't like E.T. This isn't like E.T. Oh, no. Oh. I had a plan, and it did not work the way I wanted it to at all. Hello there, everyone. Welcome back to the channel. Did you know that the Grand Theft Auto 5 VR mod is still playable in 2024? I didn't know that. I thought we had lost this to the ages. I had attempted on multiple occasions to get this working again, and I couldn't roll the game back. I couldn't figure out how to roll back GTA 5 to an older version that would allow me to use the VR mod. But then, of course, I went into the Flat to VR Discord channel, and there's a ton of people in there who know way more than me. They are way smarter, and they provided me with the information I needed to get this working again in 2024, and I am ecstatic. I am so happy I could punch this man in the face. Yeah, that's exactly what you get, mate. That's what that's what happens when you hide this from me. Okay? You should have told me that I could still play GTA 5 in VR. You dick. So here I am, back in probably my favorite VR mod of all time. Like this and Resident Evil 2 in full VR with motion controls. They're probably tied for the number one spot. Like, there's a lot of incredible VR mods out there. Um, and I'd probably include the Unreal Engine VR mod as well in the kind of a joint third place or first place between those three mods. Um, but this one holds a really special place in my heart because of the scale of GTA 5. There aren't many games this size with this kind of open world where you can just come in here and go crazy. And in VR, that's so special. Who are these people that I haven't punched? Uh, GTA 5 is like so well optimized for most machines now that you can get this running and looking amazing on pretty much all platforms. Um, it's 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 honestly bonkers. Right, I'm gonna hold on. Uh, how close? Mm. <laughs> oh, that was amazing. He did like a front flip. Over this little ledge. Oh, he's dead. Who who would have thunk it? Right, I'm going to run around and cause some uh, chaos. Just have some fun. Because honestly, I've missed this mod so much. I'm so happy that I can play it again. You can probably tell. Um, I will leave the links to get all the files that you need. Like the rollback and all of that in the description to this video. So check that out. And uh, yeah, let's uh, let's cause some carnage. I'm going to fly this. I think this is a... Is it a buzzard? Uh, and a no, an annihilator, an annihilator helicopter. Let's fly this into uh, the city. I think flying helicopters, uh, just using vehicles in general, is probably my favourite part of this whole mod. It is fan bloody tastic. Now, also for the very first time, I've applied a trainer um, to the game. I've never really mucked around much with GTA modding. Uh, but I've got a trainer on here today, so I can like change the time of day, I can give myself any weapons I want, I can play as whatever kind of character model I want to. I'm currently playing as a zombie, that's why my arms are all like bloody and pale and horrible. Um, so yeah, I'm currently playing as a zombie, which is, which is pretty cool. Let's shoot some cars on this road. Oh yes! I'm missing everything! It's amazing! Right, fly down into the street. Whoa! <laughs> oh my! Oh shit! Oh shit! It's okay. Ah, uh, we can save it. We can save it. I'm a great pilot. We saved it. We saved it. <laughs> oh, I thought I was done for then. I must have knocked into something. Oh, man. There aren't uh, many VR games oh, that will make you feel as nauseous as flying a helicopter in GTA 5 can make you feel. I can't believe that doing this has only earned me two stars so far. I guess I haven't blown up any cars or actually killed anyone. Um, not that I know of, anyway. Uh, but still, it's quite uh, shocking. 
They would only give me two stars. Around this corner. Oh, don't hit the building. <laughs> Matt, I don't know if I've played this mod since I've had my 4090. It feels way smoother than it ever did before. Maybe this is the first time I'm playing it on this system. I can't remember when the mod was like removed from Luke's Patreon channels and removed as a, as a file that was being updated when Rockstar kind of came along and went, Oi, stop doing that. Stop doing that. Stop making our game better. Ah! By giving new players options. How dare you? How dare you give people something that we're not willing to give? Look at the scope of it. Look at the scale of this game. It's just crazy. Flying around amongst these skyscrapers. Flying down to floor level. Just breathe it in. It is absolutely insane. Every time I come back to this mod, I'm like, just flabbergasted by how flipping awesome it is and it could have been even better because Luke's upgraded his uh, real mod so much uh, since he had the ability to work on this but then obviously Rockstar shut it down and there have been no updates since so the mod itself is old you know it's running on an old version of the real mod but God, it's still so flipping cool man can I land on that helipad probably not I'm not very good <laughs> at like really precise maneuvers. Oh, I don't know, saying that. I'm doing quite well. Okay, come on. Is it bring it in slowly? Slowly. Slowly. Sl slowly. Down. Cross. Come on. Oh, don't clock it up now. Oh, yeah. I am a zombie pilot. I smashed that. Look at that. Fantastic. Oh, actually, to be fair, I didn't do great. The back wheel is definitely not on the building. Okay, well, it is what it is. Can I snipe people from up here? Does the scope go that far? Surely not. Oh! Goes pretty far. Uh, oh, it goes even farther than that! Oh my god, there's a man... Okay, I can't look. It's too jiggly. There's a man on the bike there. Oh, I hit him! Uh, okay, I actually think I killed a man there. I'm not sure how because the site was like so jiggly, but I'm pretty sure I just killed a man. So that's cool. Um, let's just do one of these. Woo! There it goes. Oh, I don't think I killed anyone. Let's try the highway. Let's try and hit... Hmm, if I go now, there, it might hit that car that's coming. Oh. Oh. Oh, too early. Uh, okay, how do I use the parachute? I've not played this game in about 400 years. Um, do I just jump and hope for the best? Is that is that how this works? Sounds a little bit scary to me. Uh, okay, let's just jump. How do I use it? Oh, thank God. Woo! Very nice. Right, let's parachute down to safety. And then we'll get in a car. And we'll just go for a little joyride. Look at my zombie arms. That's so cool. I might change character. Uh, no, I'm not going to change character. I'm, I'm going to be a zombie forever. Here we go. Hello, ladies. How's it going? You right? Pretty impressive, huh? We apologize where I'm from. Shut up. What is happening? That's what you get. That's what you get. I'm from there as well. I'm from Britain. We don't apologize. We never apologize. We don't apologize for anything. Kick you in the bum. Right. I need a car because the police are coming now. Uh, all these cars are like SUVs. Why are there no cars that aren't SUVs? This is ridiculous. Okay, I'll just take the police car. That'll do. Oi. Come on. Get out of the way. I need a car. Oh, he got hit by a car. That sucks for him. Okay, right. In we go. In we go. I just need your car. Hell yeah. Let's go. See you later, guys. See you later. Woohoo. All right, I can't remember what handbrake is. Is it A? I don't know. We're about to find out. Okay, I think I know what handbrake is now. I think it's RB. Oh, that is definitely handbrake. <laughs> God, that feels good. Thread the needle. Thread the... And that's not threading anything. Oh, no. I'm not threading anything. Jeez. Around this corner. Oh, my God. <laughs> that feels so good. Like, handbrake sliding around corners whilst running away from the cops. It feels so cool. Ah. Oh. We need like an open world game like this built for VR where my hand movements uh, ow, translate ow, into, uh, you know, real interactions. A proper native open world VR game. We might have ditched the car. 
Dish the car. Oh, there I go. Oh, it's got no front end. It's got no front end. Dude, you're not going to make it. This is going to suck. Oh, okay, this sucks. This sucks. This sucks. This sucks. Uh, right, get out. Get out, bro. Get out the car, dude. Dude, get out the car. Why won't you get out the car? Oh, I'm dead. I'm so dead. Okay. Well, that happened. Let's just take a little walk. Let's have a little walk around the city. Let's just breathe it all in. Weasel Dorset. Can I go in here? Hey! What are you saying? Hey! Shut up! Stupid bucket hat wearing idiot. Uh, nothing against people who wear bucket hats. I'm all about that Kevin and Perry lifestyle. I just really like punching people. <laughs> oh no! Andrew Tate's coming for me! Take that Andrew Tate, you shit! Oh, he, he dodged me! Okay, it doesn't actually look like Andrew Tate now that I'm fighting him. Jesus Christ, just a bold man. Just a bold man with a bit of a goatee. Get on the piss of... Why is he so tough? My God, stay down. Stay down. All right, let's open up my little trainer. There it is. Okay, so this little thing's called Menu. Um, I'll put the link for this in the description as well. Really easy to install. Um, and in here, you can just like change the time of day. You can change the weather. So if you want to go uh, thunder all of a sudden, it's thundery. So we can... Oh, <laughs> Right, let's do thunder, and let's spawn in a motorbike, and yeah, we'll, we'll just burn around the uh, thunderstorm on a motorbike. Right, we've got a beastie looking motorbike. I don't know if this is a good one. I don't know which of the motorbikes in GTA are the good ones. We have a crazy thunderstorm going on. Look at the rain. It's nuts. Uh, the clouds are looking very angry, and occasionally you'll get these massive forks of lightning as well. There's one! Oh, it looks so cool. And I think that's like the perfect weather to go for a oh, motorbike ride. All right, let's do this. Uh, can I get back into like the main the main city? Here we go. Helicopter overhead. Honestly, like something about riding motorbikes in VR, like in GTA 5, in Cyberpunk 2077, is so cool. Like driving cars is fine, but motorbikes is a whole step up. It's really intense. <laughs> Way scarier as well. Because you're kind of exposed. You're right out there with the elements and threading the needle and getting close to cars is quite scary. Oh my god, look at the thunder in the background. Oh, this, oh <laughs> look at the thunder! It's nuts. Holy sh I'm on the wrong side of the road. Man, look at that! The whole sky lights up when the lightning hits. I've never really taking the time to look at how good the weather looks in this game. I mean, compared to something like Red Dead 2, which had all like the volumetric clouds, it's, it's pretty basic now. But uh, when you see the whole sky light up like that from the the thunder and the lightning, it, that is that is very cool looking. Especially in VR. I cannot even see the city below me. I don't even know if the city is below me. I think it is. There are some cars there. This thunderstorm is nuts. <laughs> Absolutely nuts. It's a little bit scary. Uh, I like the way that everything lights up though. When the uh, when the lightning strikes. Flipping hell. So atmospheric. It's crazy. Oh, look at that. Flipping heck. So good. All right, I need to uh, brighten things up because it is very very gloomy. And, uh, oh, look at the thunder and the lightning. It's amazing. Right, park my chopper here, I guess. This looks like a good place to park. Ah, there we go. Oh, no, I'm falling over. Get out, get out. Oh, Jesus Christ, it fell on me. Oh, no. My zombie. He's so dead. Look how beautiful this game is. It's crazy. So it's just been raining, and the floor is wet because of that. And now you can see all the water that's kind of pooled on the roads blowing in the wind. It's, it's actually nuts how good GTA 5 still looks. And this is like a completely unmodded, vanilla version of GTA 5. I haven't done anything to the graphics. I just have the trainer for menu so I can spawn in stuff and muck around with the weather and things. But I haven't touched the graphics. But look at it. After the rainstorm, all the rain is still here. All these puddles are still here. Blowing in the wind. You can see the ripples. 
Like, this is, it's a crazy feat. Okay, it's all, like, soggy and pooled here in the, on the grass as well. I wonder how long it will take for this to clear and for the roads to become dry again. There's obviously a cycle involved in that, like, in time. It's already, I guess, it looks like it's starting to happen already, actually. Hello. You alright? Enjoying that coffee? Cheeky little Starbucks? Oh my god, they look so terrifying. Why are they blankly looking at me like this? Hello? You alright? <laughs> Hello? What's what's happening? Right, punching spree. Ugh, take that. You're next, mate. Ugh, get down. Oh, you with your stupid hat. Come here. Come here. Ah! I love how the hats go flying. Come here, you. Oh, I'm not as fast. I'm not as fast as this guy. He's going to get away. Oh, no, he's not. Oh, take that. No. Stay down. Oh, my God. It really is just the uh, terrible person simulator. He says as he removes an RPG from his backpack. Shut up. You knobs. Mm, you've got a nice car. I do not want to blow it up. I do not want to blow it up. Hey, hey, none of that. Take that, you shits. Uh, see if I can hit that. There. Oh, that was close, wasn't it? What about there? Oh, oh it's so bloody hard to hit the helicopters. They're wily little bastards. I can hit you, though. Super easy to hit you. Oh, what are you doing? What are you doing? Oh, you're a collateral damage now, son. You're coll oh, my zombie got shot in the butt cheek and died. Mate, I need more health. Oh my god, this trainer can do some crazy stuff. Explosive melee. Explosive melee? What the hell is explosive melee? I don't know what this means. What does it mean? <laughs> what, the what even happened? Stop the car. Stop the car. Stop the car. Stop the car. I need to test something. Stop the car. Can I punch a car and make it explode? <laughs> I can, but I will also die. Right, note to self, don't punch cars because you will die. I don't know if my explosive melee is still on. Let's just do a quick test. Yeah, that's definitely still on. That is definitely still on. I have grenades attached to my hands. And people just die immediately. It makes a really satisfying noise. I wish they flew a bit further, though. Come here, you. Come here, you cheeky demon. <laughs> oh, my God. You're next. Ugh. Look at these people running in fear of my explosive fists. <laughs> I don't blame them. I don't blame I would be running too. <laughs> I'd be running too. Oh, bro, you're not getting away. You are not. There's no way you're getting away. You're running for your life, but you're never going to make it. You're never going to make it. Uh, there. Oh, it's good. It's good. It's so hard to hit the bloody helicopters. I'm terrible at it. Is that a person? Oh, that was a person. Felt a bit bad when I saw his floppy body falling towards the floor. There's a real odd juxtaposition in this game because it's actually quite beautiful. Um, like, <laughs> like just to look at it, like the the cityscape, the ah, skybox and everything. But then you spend all your time just murdering people, or at least I do. I just turned on bullet time. I don't know if that's something I have to activate or if it will just go on when I shoot. Oh, it is just going slow mo when I shoot. Max Payne style. Slow-mo, baby! Slow-mo! Take his wheels out! Oh, the reloads look really good in VR. I wish I could do them, obviously, with my own hands, but... We can't have everything. Can't have everything. Can't be a greedy boy. Oh, my God. Slow-mo whilst driving a car is flipping awesome. Take that. Oh. Oh, it's so good! Uh-oh. Ah! I forgot to look where I was going. That's my fault. That's on me. Reload the gun. Shoot him off the side. Shoot the wheel out. Oh, I'm going to crash. I'm going to crash. There's no stop in that. Oh, maybe I'll dodge it. What in the fuck? How did I dodge that? That was nuts. Where are you going, lads? You're going the wrong way. I'm this way. Woo, yeah. Where are you going? <laughs> you cannot say. Oh, this doesn't look cool. This looks nuts. Go, 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 go. Oh, yeah. 
Helicopter shadow above me. That ain't good. That ain't good. They're going to get me. How many stars am I on? Four. Oh, they're pissed. They are pissed. Bus drive by. Take the tyres out. Take the tyres out. Yes, we get one. <laughs> the slow mo is too flipping cool. I cannot. Oh, stop playing with it. What the hell? It's flipping amazing. You can even make it snow and make the snow stay on the ground. That's cool. That's very cool. My very own winter wonderland to uh, drive around in. Oh, man. I love this kind of like sunset looking skybox as well. It looks really like nice over here. Kind of like a pinky hue to it. Uh, I could drive around in here all day. I mean, look at that. Plane overhead. Two planes overhead. Thought we were going to collide, but that one's going way faster. Damn, that car looks amazing. It's got like a kind of a black, but also green paint job. It's like an iridescent thing going on. It, like looks green as I move along it, but from a distance it looks black. Damn, that is a nice looking car. Jesus. Oh. I don't want to trash this one. I want to keep this one. Oh. Oh. Wait. Oh. What the? You deserve that, you dick. Scratch my car up. Flipping heck. <laughs> this game is so good because stuff like that just happens. Weird emergent gameplay. And that's why it's been you know, so popular for so long. No one, ah, no one has the exact same experience playing this game. The police are chasing me, but they have no hope in hell of catching me in this car. Oh no! Where am I? Who am I? Hello? Hello? Okay, car is mm, it's not looking great now. Oh, oh no! Oh no! Oh no! I blame you! I blame you! Oh no! <laughs> I forgot I had the slow mo on. That was that was mean. That was mean, is what that was. That that wasn't needed. Oh, you're gonna make it! Oh, you made it, you cheeky sausage. GTA in VR, it's just a dream come true. And I honestly probably don't think we're ever going to get that uh, San Andreas on Quest. When the hell was that announced? Was it like three years ago? Maybe they're just taking their sweet time making it the absolute best it can physically be. That's me being optimistic. Um, but it's just crazy that we haven't seen anything since the announcement, you know? Crazy! <laughs> yes! Ah! I know I'm just causing carnage. I know this whole video is just me blowing things up, but uh, I've got to say, I'm having a fantastic Sunday. This is the best way to spend a Sunday. Take that, you shitty shitterson! Woohoo! Oh no. Oh, what have I done? Oh, oh no! <laughs> I changed the gravity to, to Pluto's gravity. Uh, and that's made some interesting things happen. Uh, oh, oh! You're right! Okay. <laughs> what is going on? What is going on? Oh my god. Why is it not affecting me in that way? Like, I, I'm not like, ow, 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 ow. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. I think I'm just flying out of control. I don't think I'll ever come back to the ground. There's a flying car up there. It's just suspended in the air. Uh, so if I crash this car now, am I going to start flying? I really hope so. I want to go across a jump or something and just like, just fly off into the sky. Uh, I don't know where the nearest jump is. Uh, maybe I have to crash. Oh, that didn't work. So if I blow them all up, are they going to fly off into the sky? Yeah, look at that. Those, well, oh, the debris is <laughs> it's all flying everywhere. <laughs> oh god, it's so wacky. It's, 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 it's an amazing VR mod. It's an amazing game, but it's just made even better with the trainer. That allows you to do all kinds of stupid stuff. 
There she goes. There she goes. <laughs> the flying, burning woman. <laughs> oh, I can't get her again. I can't quite get her again. There she is, there she is, there she is, there she is. Oh, she's dead. I'm dead. Everyone's dead. Bugger. Buggery bollocks. Right, I'm going to leave it here. This has been Grand Theft Auto 5 in VR in 2024. It's still possible. There are a few more steps. You can't just apply the mod and press play now. You have to roll back files. But honestly, the process of doing that is super simple. I will put a link to a different video from a different creator in the description for this video because he explains it really concisely and honestly it is just dragging and dropping the required files. You drop those files across and then you can play it in VR again and it's just as good as it ever was. It's definitely one of the best VR mods out there. It's an amazing experience, just this huge sandbox for chaos available to you at your fingertips. There's nothing like this in VR, and it might not have all the shine and polish of Luke Ross's newer mods, or newer VR mods in general, but there's something really special about GTA 5 in VR, and I think there always will be. Hopefully you've enjoyed this video. If you have, please do leave a like, leave a comment, hit subscribe, all that good stuff, and I'll see you soon for another video. I am going to spend my Sunday playing this, and uh, yeah, I'd advise you all to do the same. Take care, everyone. See you later. Oh boy. Woohoo! <laughs> Look at him go! Look at him go! Flamey boy! Flame! <laughs> oh dear. Oh, oh, is that them there? Are they still going? Yep, yeah, there he goes! <laughs> oh, off he is. He's gone. <laughs> he's, he's gone. Never to be seen again. Oh, amazing.